Talking with uh, Chris Leonard, uh, one of my favorite composers. I grew up listening to you, and Thank you. you did an amazing job last week at the Rest concert. It was great, wasn't it? I mean, and for me, like, first of all, it was a little daunting, but second of all, an amazing honor to be able to basically conduct and arrange music from the people I worked for. Um, I decided to be a composer after I snuck into a Henry Mancini set scoring session, and then I got to work for Basil Polidorus and Michael Kamen. So when I put together that piece, I made sure to include all of them. But, you know, let me tell you, conducting Robocop after all these years is, you know, I felt I felt some pressure, but it was, it was, it was, I was like chills. It was like chills. And so Revolution's coming back next year. Congrats. It is. Thank you very much. Um, so how do you, how do you plan on expanding your musical universe that you've set up? Like, do, do the writers have a plan? Do you kind of work as it as a season, as an arc? Or? They haven't told me a lot. I will tell you they haven't told me a lot. But, actually there's one thing that I was just going to say that I shouldn't say yet because it's not on the air. But, there will be a big change next year um, in terms of the world and the universe that it exists in. And I think that will open up a lot of possibilities for me. Um, I don't think there's going to be any change in, in, in the idea as far as a show that we're going to definitely have our live orchestra, which I think is, is, is a trademark of the show. We're going to definitely have uh, the the sort what I would call the, the the sort of medieval elements, the dulcimers and the big drums and the, that stuff. But I think there may be some more additions, uh, maybe some vocals, maybe some other stuff that will have to do with the new storylines. Right, right. And I think it will be really great. And you have uh, As Cool As I Am coming out, which reunites you with uh, Max Mayer. How is it like working with him again after Adam? It was awesome. Adam was an amazing experience for me. It was such a great movie. And As Cool As I Am is a phenomenal movie as well. Um, so obviously you have uh, you know Claire Danes who won an Emmy and you have James Marsden who's amazing but this girl Sarah Bolger who I believe was on the Tudors is amazing mind-blowing like carries like just unbelievable career-changing performance she's like a young Jodie Foster <laughs> and she's so good and we got to do this really intimate amazing score but has some real interesting parts to it including things like I mean, it's got some tango, it's got some accordion, but it's also got guitars and, and, and stuff. It's a really great little movie, and it's very different than what I do on things like Revolution or ID Thief or things like that. So it, I always try to keep doing uh, character-driven movies as well, because it's, it's, it's sort of what I love, so you do it's really, really nice. Well, so. It's a different thing, but I love it, yeah, you know? Well, thank you so much, Chris, and sure, uh, man. congrats, and have a good night. Nice to see you here.